Welcome to the Velvet Room. I thought about resuming our previous conversation tonight. That is why I have summoned you. What are your thoughts? Are you becoming accustomed to this place? Ah, glad to hear it. It seems you have nerves of steel. The goal of your rehabilitation is to thwart the fated ruin. However, such a feat cannot be done by you alone. Today, you entered a partnership with someone who awoke to the same power, did you not? Involving yourself with others is an important foundation for your recovery. You've done well. That said, I am not advising the formation of superficial relationships. It must not be a frivolity, but a ring of those who would, by morals or faith, lend you their strength. In other words, they are bonds with those who have been robbed of their places to belong. The expansion of said ring will, in return, help you mature as well. Personas are the strength of heart. The stronger the bonds that surround you, the more power your personas will gain. There are countless people in the city who have talents that a weakling like you doesn't. You better rack that noggin of yours and get them on your side. We'll change that into power. Indeed, you should be prepared to use even myself or your ambitions will not come to fruition. <laughs> we have a deal then. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Fool Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Well, you will understand it all in due time. Continue devoting yourself to your rehabilitation. Now this conversation's over. Get lost, inmate. How annoying. We've barely started high school and already they're making us play at a volleyball rally? And why are they pitting us against the teacher team? Kamoshida's gonna crush us. We get to see his technique live and in person, though. We should totally get spiked on. Yeah, okay. You're gonna get your face smashed in. Just look at how banged up the volleyball team is. What the hell goes on during their practices? Okay, quiet down. Still sticks out. Hasn't changed a bit. 
Hmm? Uh, pretty boring. Right? Sorry. Hey, are you all right? Someone, take him to the nurse's office. You get that song. He'll pay soon enough. All right, let's resume the match. That asshole's acting like a king over here, too. Get to know each other better, my ass. It's just a one-man show for him to stroke his ego. Oh, oh, and how he acted like he was worried about Mishima. Oh, what an abusive D-bag. <clears throat> Now's our chance to go look for the guys we saw were slaves yesterday. Let's look for the faces we saw at the castle. All the members of the team should be here today. I'll be sure to find someone to spill about Kamoshida's physical abuse. Just you wait, asshole. The first one that popped out was a guy from Class D, so let's start from there. That's your class. Hopefully you can get him to talk without any issues. People have been avoiding me lately, so... Oh, but you're kind of in the same boat, huh? What? Are you skipping out on the volleyball rally? I guess I expect it from you, Transfer. Hey, that's the guy who was over at that castle. You too, Sakamoto? What do you guys want? What? W what, are you, what are you saying? No, of course not. It's Kamoshida, ain't it? Look, I ain't gonna tell anyone you squealed. Just tell us about how Kamoshida's abusing you. I... I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not. You guys are talking complete nonsense. Don't try and hide it. We already know. You know? You have proof. Well, uh, I... This is ridiculous. Please, leave me alone. You're really bothering me. <sighs> All right, that's enough. Come on, let's go. That injury ain't normal, and he still won't fess up. Ah, crap. If we keep going at this pace, the ball game's gonna end. I guess that'd be faster. I'll check the practice building for people before clubs start. You handle the classroom building. There's a third year on the volleyball team that I remember. I think he's in 3C? He was getting beat pretty badly at the castle. He might have some injuries here too. Anyways, I'll hit you up if I find anything. See ya. I can't do it!
Can I talk to you for a sec? It'll be quick. Anyway, what's with you? Like how you were late the other day was a lie and all? There's that weird rumor about you, too. What do you want with him? Right back at you. You're not even in our class. We just happen to get to know each other. What are you planning on doing to Mr. Kamoshida? Huh? I see. I get ya. You're all buddy-buddy with Kamoshida after all. This has nothing to do with you, Sakamoto. If you found out what he's been doing behind your back, you dump him right away. Behind my back? What's that supposed to mean? <sighs> you wouldn't get it. Anyway, people are already talking about you two. I don't know what you're trying to pull, but no one's gonna help you. I'm warning you, just in case. That's all. Why she gotta be so aggressive all the time? We just went to the same middle school. Anyways, that's not what we're here to talk about. I had no luck on my end. What about you? Did anything like someone's name turn up? Huh? Special coaching, huh? True. I always see the guy covered in bruises. Let's go talk to him before he leaves then. Hey! Got a second? Sakamoto? And you, too. Come on, we just want to chat. Kamoshida's been coaching you, huh? You sure it's not just physical abuse? Certainly not. What are you talking all polite for? Anyways, we saw him spike you today. Right in the face. That was just because I'm not good at the sport. Still, that doesn't explain all the other bruises you've got. They're from practice. Is he forcing you to keep quiet? That's... What's going on here? Mishima, isn't it time for practice? Uh, I'm not feeling well today. What? Maybe you're better off quitting then. You're never going to improve that crappy form unless you show up to practice. Didn't you hear? He ain't feeling well. Well, Mishima, are you coming to practice or not? I'll go. As for you, any more trouble and you'll be gone from this school for sure. Bastard. Same goes for you. Didn't the principal tell you to keep in line? <laughs> Just don't get in the way of my practice. All these unsettling rumors are making the students anxious after all. That's your own goddamn fault. <laughs> this won't get us anywhere. Let's go, Mishima. Shujin Academy is a place where those with aspirations come to learn. Unworthy students like yourselves don't have any right to be here. Get with the program. Yes, sir. That asshole. He's gonna pay for this. There's no point. Huh? Proving that he's physically abusing us is meaningless. Everybody knows. The principal, our parents, they all know, and they all keep quiet about it. This has got to be a joke! Don't be a pain. You don't understand what I'm going through. Shouldn't you of all people know that nothing's going to help? <sighs> Damn it. I'll try one more time to persuade the other guys. That's all I can do.
Shouldn't you be heading to volleyball? Uh-huh. That bruise above your eye. Is that from practice, too? Y yeah Are you sure you're not pushing yourself too hard? I'm okay. Volleyball's the only thing I can do right. Shouldn't you take that? It's probably just my part-time job, I think. I should get going. Shiho. Um, are you sure you're okay? Uh-huh. Yes. T today won't work. I'm... I'm not feeling so good. Sorry. Bye. Hey, wasn't that Takamaki? Rumor has it she's dating Kamoshida. Seriously? I heard people saw them in his car together. You know, she seems pretty easy, huh? You think I'd have a chance to? Come on, dude. You can't go after Kamoshida's bitch. Way, aren't I? Sorry. Huh? Um, well. Hmm. You don't look familiar. Could you be that transfer student from Class D? Um, this might not be any of my business, but don't let the rumors get to you, okay? I'm glad to hear that. My best friend is often misunderstood, too. All because of her looks. Uh, sorry. I didn't mean to drag on like that. Anyway, I have to go to practice. I'll see you around. Damn it! What the hell? <sighs> is that what it looks like? All of them kept saying the same shit Mishima was talking about. Kamoshida had to have told him something. At this rate, looks like we'll have to go to him directly. I know. But seriously, isn't there something we can do? No way I'm gonna give in like this. Can you think of anything? So you want to tell him about the castle? They'd never believe us. Have any other ideas? Oh, that'd be fine if we could do it without getting caught, but if we did, we'd be seriously done for. You got any other ideas? What do we do? The king? You mean that other world's Kamoshida? I didn't think of that, but is there any meaning to... I finally found you! You say something. Don't think you can get away with not paying me back for helping you. That voice... Is that you, Morgana? How dare you up and leaving me the other day? The cat's talking? I am not a cat! This is just what happened when I came to this world. It was a lot of trouble finding you two. Wait, you came to our world? <gasps> Does that mean you've got a phone? You don't need one when you're at my level. I did get pretty lost making my escape, though. That aside, why can you talk? You're a cat! How should I know? You hearing this too? This is no time to be joking around! You guys are having a rough time of this, hmm. I heard you mention something about witnesses. Oh, shut up! You know, I could tell you a thing or two about what to do about Kamashita. You were pretty close just a moment ago. God, that condescending attitude. This thing's gotta be Morgana. You were still doubting me? God, quiet down! Uh, we really have to be looking for a cat in a busy time like this? I just heard a meow somewhere near here. Didn't you hear it? Uh, make sure you check every nook and cranny around. Meow? Does that mean only us two can understand what you're saying? Looks like it. What the hell's going on? 
Anyways, what you were talking about earlier, is it for real? You're quite the skeptic for being an idiot. Hey, tell us more. Then again, this probably ain't the best place. Here, stick it in your bag for now. It should be just small enough to fit. Hey, how dare you treat me like... Don't be so rough with me. Enough of that. You said you know how we can do something about Kamoshida, right? It has to do with what this guy was talking about earlier. You'll need to attack his castle. What do you mean? That castle is how Kamoshida views this school. He doesn't realize what happens in there, but it's deeply connected to the depths of his heart. Thus, if the castle disappears, it would naturally impact the real Kamoshida. What had happened? A palace is a manifestation of a person's distorted desires. So, if that castle were no more... Precisely. You sure pick up things fast. For real? He he's gonna turn good? But is that really getting back at him? Erasing a palace essentially means forcing the owner to have a change of heart. However, even though their warped wants disappear, the crimes they committed remain. Kamoshida will become unable to bear the weight of those crimes. And he'll confess them himself. You for real? That's possible? And since the palace will no longer exist, he'll forget what we did there as well. Not only will we be able to bring Kamoshida down, but there won't even be a trace of our involvement. That's amazing! You are one incredible cat! True. Except for the cat part. So, how do we get rid of the palace? By stealing the treasure held within. Stealing? I'll tell you more once you agree to go ahead with this. It's my most valuable secret plan, after all. If you want to help me out, I'll gladly teach you. What's your call? Our luck's running dry looking for witnesses. Guess we have no choice but to go along. Good. Oh, right. There's one more thing I should tell you. If we erase a palace, there is no doubt that the person's distorted desires will be erased as well. But desires are what we all need in order to survive. The will to sleep, eat, fall in love. Those sorts of things. What are you getting at? If all of those yearnings were to vanish, they'd be no different than someone who is shut down entirely. They may even die if they're not given proper care. So... They might die! Will you listen to everything I have to say first? Would their death be our fault? Aren't you determined enough to face those kinds of risks? Hey, what do you think? Well, of course not! Sheesh. I come all this way and this is what I get. It's not like anyone will ever find out. That's not the point! If we just go around secretly doing whatever we want, we'd be no better than that effing Kamoshida! <sighs> Isn't this your only option? I'll come back later. Make sure you've made your decision by then. Man, we're getting all worked up for nothing. Damn it! I'll try and see if I can figure out another way. Come on, let's get out of here. Feeling up to it. Wait, what? That's not what you promised. And you call yourself a teacher? This has nothing to do with Shiho. Uh, <sighs> Shiho's starting position. Wait, were you listening? <sighs> Haven't you heard of privacy? 
No, I was out of line. Sorry. So, how much did you hear? See, that is true. It's nothing at all. Nothing. about me <laughs> what the heck I really don't get you I don't have anything to talk about with you it was just an argument thank you very much you've heard the rumors haven't you about Mr. Kamoshida. Everyone says we're getting it on. But that's so not true. <clears throat> that was him on the other line. I avoided giving him my number for the longest time. He told me to go to his place after this. <sighs> you know what it means. If I turn him down, he said he'd take my friend off as a regular on the team. I've been telling myself this is all for Shiho's sake. I can't take it anymore. Uh, uh. I've had enough of this. I hate him. But still, Shiho's my best friend. She's all I have left in that sorry excuse of a school. Tell me, what should I do? Sorry, I shouldn't have asked. It's not your problem. <laughs> what? What am I saying? I've barely even talked to you before. Huh? So weird. Usually everyone just ignores me. Are you really a bad person? I've heard people talking about you, but I just don't see it. <laughs> Is that supposed to be a joke? I kinda had a feeling they were all just exaggerations. You seemed lonely. Almost like you didn't belong anywhere. You're the same in that regard. Maybe that's why it was so easy for me to talk to you. Is there really no way for me to help Shio? I wish he'd just change his mind. Like, forget about me and everything. As if something like that would ever happen. <laughs> I wasn't asking for a serious response. But, I do feel a bit better now. I'm gonna head home. Don't tell anyone what I told you, okay? I'll try and think of a way to persuade Kamoshida. Well... Thanks. Suzui... Are you leaving? What is it? Mr. Kamashita's asking for you. He's in the PE faculty office. What did he say? I don't know. Well, I have to go.
You're late. Where have you been? Don't give me those lies. By the way, you haven't been hanging around any bad influences, have you? Huh. Well, they've got to be pretty strange to want to spend time with you. Just make sure you're careful who your friends are, if you don't want them ruining your life. Ooh, look at the time. Seriously, think about how I feel having to stay up here waiting for you. Hey, I'm leaving. In the future, try not to come back so damn late. Understood? So I assume all of you know about the separation of powers. There are three branches in our government. The National Diet is legislative, the Cabinet is executive, and the Supreme Court is judiciary. This division of power provides checks and balances, which ensures no one branch becomes unstoppable. Have you made up your mind? No matter how much thinking you do, there's only one option. You'd be better off just listening to me. Hmm, did I just hear a cat just now? <coughs> Meow! Hmm, could that rumored cat be somewhere nearby? Settle down! We're in the middle of an important lecture. If you only knew, I'm reading this too. What's that? Enough! This is a classroom! Wait, she's going to jump! Suzui? Shiho? For real? Come Who on, let's go. Hey, stay in your seats! Do not step foot outside of this room! No way! Huh? Is she gonna commit suicide? It's Suzui! Shio Suzui! Huh? Suzui, hey, son! Let's go look! We should head to the courtyard, too. Really? Hey, that's him. Hey, let me through! What the hell? Let me through, man! Please! Session. Shio. What the hell's wrong with these people? We need someone to go with her. Are there any teachers around? Uh, I'm not in charge of her class, though. So we should leave this to Principal Kobayakawa. I'll go. Please hurry. Shio. Why? Mon, I'm sorry. I can't take this anymore. Shio? Huh? Kamoshida? 
No! Shia! Did you see that? Uh, Her leg was totally the wrong way! It's not way. Way. She what just she just wants you Volleyball team! team. Return to your classrooms at once! <sighs> that guy... Hey, wasn't Mishima acting weird? We're gonna make him talk this time. Teachers, return to your classrooms for the time being. Please do not let any students go home yet. Ah, that hurts. Why'd you run like that, huh? I didn't run. She jumped and tried to kill herself. L leave me alone. He's right. We ain't trying to get you busted. We won't say you talked either. Suzui. She was called out by Mr. Kamashita. Wait, what? I was called by him a number of times too. To the teacher's room. It wasn't just me or Suzui either. He'd nominate someone when he was in a bad mood and hit them. So the physical punishment thing was for real. Yesterday, he called Suzui out of the blue. She didn't make any mistakes or anything. Mr. Kamashita seemed really irritated that day. So it must have been... worse than usual. He didn't... That son of a bitch! Uh... I bet... Sakamoto's going to find Mr. Kamashita. Mr. Kamashita's probably in the PE faculty office on the second floor. This sucks. That can't be. He went into the PE faculty office. Let's hurry. We have to go after him. Really? Huh? You bastard! What the hell did you do to that girl? What are you talking about? Don't! Play dumb with me! That is enough! What you did was in coaching. What did you say? You... You ordered me to call Suzui here. I can only imagine what you did to her. You're going on and on about things you have no proof of. Basically, you're simply making these claims because you can't be a regular on the team, right? That's not what this is about! Even if it is exactly as you imagine it to be, hypothetically speaking, what can you do? We just received a call from a hospital. Suzui's in a coma, and her chances of recovery are slim. How would someone like that make a statement? There's no chance of her getting better, I hear. Oh, the poor girl. No. I can't be. You goddamn... This again? Does this mean we need to have yet another case of self-defense? You shut your mouth, you son of a bitch! Why are you stopping me? But still! Oh, you're stopping him? What a surprise. There's no need to hold back. Why not attack me? Oh, you can't. <laughs> but of course you can. Everyone present right now will be expelled. I'm reporting all of you at the next board meeting. What? You can't make a decision like that. Who would seriously consider what scum like you say? You threaten me too, Mishima. So you're just as responsible. Huh? To think you didn't know why I kept someone as talentless as you on the team. You act like you're a victim. But you leaked his criminal records, didn't you? It's all over the internet, correct? How terrible. Mishima? He told me to do it. I had no choice. <laughs> now, are we finished here? You're all expelled. You're done for. Your futures are mine to take. Now get out of my sight. I 
can't believe this asshole's getting away with this! Huh? Oh, right! We have that! Huh? Have you lost your minds? You worthless kids aren't making any sense. But sure, go ahead and try. After all, you'll have plenty of time to kill until expulsion. We can't waste any time. We gotta hurry up and go to that world and beat the shit out of that asshole. We're not beating him up. We're simply stealing his distorted desires. Can I assume that you've made up your minds about this? About how he might suffer a mental shutdown? I have. Someone almost died because of him. I don't give a rat's ass what happens to him anymore. And you? Then it's settled. By the way, is getting rid of a palace hard? You've tried it before, right? When did I ever say that? Huh? What? Were you just pretending to know? Is it true that you're getting expelled? Everyone's talking about it. That asshole's at it again. So you came all this way to tell us that? You're going to deal with Kamoshida? Let me in on it too. You can't just sit back and do nothing after what happened to Shiho. This has nothing to do with you. Don't butt your head into this. But it does! She was my... I said don't get in our way! <sighs> that was harsh. We can't take her somewhere like that. I hope she doesn't do anything too crazy. Women can be much bolder than men at times. We just gotta hurry up and deal with Kamoshida. Let's go already! The moment we cross over, we'll treat each other like phantom thieves. So I hope you're ready. Huh? Phantom thieves? Those who covertly sneak in and stylishly steal treasure. That is what we become. <laughs> that sounds kind of cool. So we just gotta say the school, Kamoshida's name, and castle. And then we end up in Bizarro World. How the hell's all this work? Someone make it? <laughs> That's kind of creepy, but uh, eh, seems useful enough. We'll show that effing Kamoshida. Let's go. They really are going to do something. They're doing something on their phone? A name. A school? Huh? All right, time to bust on through. What is this? T Tsukamaki? <sighs> that voice, Sakamoto? And are you? Wh wh why are you here? How should I know? What's going on? Hey, where are we? Isn't this the school? I see. Perhaps she was dragged in because of that app thing. If multiple people can enter with the person who uses it, it stands to reason it'll pull anyone nearby. For real? Wait, so this is related to Kamoshida? Anyways, you gotta leave! No! The shadows are going to find us if you make a scene. No way! It's hot! Oh my god! It's a monster cat! Monster? You better explain what's going on! I won't leave until you do! <sighs> Looks like we gotta force her. But how are we supposed to do that? Just take her back to where we came in. That's how it worked last time, right? Uh, oh, yeah! Can you lend me a hand? We can't deal with Kamoshida if we don't. What are you... We'll explain after everything's over. Hey! And just where are you touching? Whoa, sorry, I didn't mean... That's not important. You guys, seriously? Ah! 
<sighs> we better be careful from now on when we use that app. You should have checked the tools you used. Why do I, the one who was just watching, know more about it than you two? Shut up. Ah, jeez. Takamaki found out right when we were starting off. We gotta deal with this fast. That girl's name is An Takamaki, right? Lady An. The shadows have noticed us. You better brace yourselves, got it? We're counting on you, Joker. Joker? Not a nickname? Don't refer to it in such a lame way. It's a code name. What kind of stupid phantom thief would use their real name? I'm not down for that. And there's no telling what kind of effect yelling our real names will have on the palace. It's just a precaution. So, uh, why is he Joker? Because he's our trump card when it comes to fighting strength. It's settled then. Next up is you, Ryuji. You'll be... let's see... thug. Are you picking a fight with me? Yeah, I'll choose it myself! <laughs> when it comes to me, it's gotta be this mask. Honestly, I actually kinda like it. What if we named me after this? Fine. Why not Skull, then? Oh, that sounds awesome! <laughs> I'm Skull! What do we do about this one's code name? How about Mona? Well, if Joker thinks it's easier to call me that, then I'll go with it. All right, from here on out, we are Joker, Skull, and Mona. We need to be absolutely thorough about using those code names from now on. All right, time to go steal this treasure thing. Let's make a dash for it. Hey, look, ain't that... Those intruders the other day were quite entertaining. However, I can't allow that trash to ransack my castle. Strengthen the security, kill them on sight. I'll reward whoever brings me their heads. Praise be to King Kamoshida! Death to the intruders! Hey, Mona, can't we just beat the crap out of him and call it a day? Look at all those soldiers, idiot. It'd be suicide. And I'm sure you don't want a repeat of last time. Besides, don't you want him to confess his sins? There's no point beating him up. We need to steal his materialized desires. The treasure. Fine, uh, so where is it? It has to be somewhere in the depths of this castle. Let's infiltrate further in while he's out here. Damn it. and all-out attacks? I'll teach you their practical use now. There's another use for holdups, besides simply defeating enemies. Shadows are beings born from people's hearts, so naturally they can talk, too. In other words, you can communicate with them. Get it? If you talk to them when they're cornered, they might offer money or items since they don't want to die. In fact, talking has a better chance of scoring something great, as opposed to just offing them. Well then, let's do the first step. Knock all the enemies down and do a hold up. Oh, down! That was incredible, Joker! Well, something along those lines. Now let it be money or items. Just cough it up. Oh, wait, what? Oh, this isn't how I was planning this to go. Uh. If that's the case, I guess it's time for you to go to hell. <gasps> Sorry, but we're in a hurry. What the? 
what's going on? Cool. I am Belle. What was that just now? What happened? For real? From earlier? Don't tell me. Did you take in the shadow's appearance and powers as a persona? Persona! Holy! Does that mean you can wield multiple personas? Hey, Mona! What was that about? What did Joker do? He sealed the enemy's appearance and powers into his mask and made it his new persona. Is such a feat even possible? Even I've never seen anyone pull that off. Of course it is. Only one heart exists per person, so normally a person can only have one persona. Incredible. That ability will give us a huge advantage in battle. All right, try to do that even more if the opportunity arises. You better help out too, Skull. Hell yeah, we'll hold every last one of them up. <laughs> I like you even more now. I really do have something special after all. Y yeah. There's a treasure chest! Show me your true form! You? Your Who true you? form. This app just said the word Sakamoto said, and I ended up. Princess? Huh? Princess! Ah! Aren't there even more shadows here than before? Just getting this far has been a real pain in my ass. 
It's all because you guys provoked Kamoshida, you know. Still, he seems to be awfully on guard. Anyways, how are we supposed to steal that treasure thing? Don't be so hasty. First, we'll need to secure an infiltration route. A uh, what? A path to the treasure's location. But honestly, I think we'll need a little more manpower in order to accomplish this. At the very least, one more person would be nice. Hey, you say you don't have your memories and all, but somehow you still know about that kind of stuff? Do you think this thing's really got amnesia? That's what you think of me? You sure talk big, but what if it turns out you're just some stray cat in the end? That can't be. Still, why was a princess in such an odd place? Princess? I could have sworn we were pursuing the readings of an intruder. It doesn't matter now. We must take her back to King Kamashita. Who's this princess they're talking about? I should probably look into this. And yet another question goes unanswered. Stuff like the castle and that navigation app are mysterious, <laughs> but Morgana's got them both beat. Oh, crap, sorry. What was I again? Oh, yeah, uh, Skull. <sighs> this is bad. That was fast. Your friend, Lady On. She's been taken by shadows! Wait, what? We sent her home earlier! If Lady On does indeed have the app, it could be possible. Oh no! Don't tell me it got put on hers just like mine! Damn it! We let her out for her own safety and she just came back in by herself! Damn it! Let's go. Is this some kind of filming? Who is in charge here? <laughs> this way! Look! I'll apologize for touching the armor without permission! Uh, she totally doesn't get what's going on. Let's hurry. We have to save her! Now then. Yes! <laughs> What's all this about? Seriously, I'm gonna call the cops! So, this is the intruder. Kamoshida? Who's that? More importantly, what is this place? Why is the school turned into something like this? I can't believe you mistook my on for someone like her. <laughs> Are you afraid? What is that outfit? Have you lost your mind? I do as I please here. After all, this is my castle. The world of my desires. What the... Wait, is this some red light district? What a lively slave. This isn't funny! Enough of the bullshit, Kamoshida! <laughs> the girls decided to tell me off. What do you think of that? Talking back is, like, totally unforgivable. In that case, she should be executed. <gasps> now then. How should I play with you? Shall I tear you into little pieces? Are you kidding me? This is effed up. Is that what he thinks of the girls on the volleyball team? Hey, that's... Takamaki! <sighs> Just when I was about to start enjoying myself. What's the deal with this guy? You little... How many times are you gonna come back? I bet you just like those thieves. You came because you're pissed at me, huh? But, uh... Ah, I forget that chick's name. But it's your fault she jumped, you know. Huh? You were so reluctant to throw yourself onto me that I had her take your place. You bastard! <gasps> no! 
Take one more step and I'll kill her on the spot. Damn it! Just sit back and enjoy the dismantlement show. No! Don't! Maybe I'll start with her clothes. <laughs> You're such a perv! Hey! What are we gonna do? Takamaki! Is this... my punishment for what happened to Shio? That's more like it. You should have looked like this from the start. Shio... I'm so sorry. Huh? You're right. Letting this piece of shit toy with me? <laughs> what was I thinking? It's like I always say, slaves should just behave and... Shut up! I've had enough of this. You piss me off, you son of a bitch! My, it's taken far too long. Uh, uh, Tell me, who is going to avenge her if you don't? Forgiving him was never the option. Such is the scream of the other you that dwells with me. I am thou, thou art I. We can finally forge a contract. I hear you, Carmen. You're right! No more holding back! <laughs> there you go. Nothing can be solved by restraining yourself. Understand? Then I'll gladly lend you my strength. Some cheap girl you can toy with, you scumbag. Bitch! You stole everything from Shiko. You destroyed her. Now it's your turn! I will rob you of everything! How dare you! Enough of your insolence! No, I've had enough of you! No one's gonna stop me now! Let's go, Carmen! How dare you deny King Kaboshida's love, you selfish lass! Pay for this insolence with your life! That dirtbag just sees women as sexual outlets! Don't make me laugh with that love bullshit! Come on, Carmen! Let's give him hell! Persona! You did it! It's all in place! Let's finish this! Okay, guys. Ready to do it! It's time. Go down! Persona! Persona! Luke's all down! You've got to help him! I'm in trouble! Carmel, back and heal! Come here, man. And more importantly, how? Hey, is that how you speak to a woman? Are you all right, Lady On? Lady On? Wait, what is this thing? Is it alive? How can it talk? And where in the world are we? J just calm down. Everything's going to be okay. Don't worry. How am I supposed to calm down? H huh? Why am I dressed like this? When did I... <sighs> What's with this? Huh? What are you talking about? 
What the hell are you thinking? Well, I'm stumped. A search party will be coming for us soon. There's no time to explain. We don't have a choice. Let's retreat for now. We were just getting fired up and you had to go and get in the way. <sighs> Fine. Here, give me your arm. You take the other side. Thanks. Looks like we made it back. Hey, are you okay? Well, pretty much. Wait, I lied. I'm still confused about all of this. You may be safe now, but a lot sure did happen back there. At any rate, we stand out too much here. Let's relocate to a safer spot. Which one you want? Whichever's not carbonated. Uh, they're both actually. Then... Here you go. What about me? Huh? But uh, you're a cat. <laughs> Have you calmed down, Lady On? Um... Morgana, right? I really am talking to a cat. <sighs> this feels so strange. Oh, sorry. You're not a cat, right? It's only natural that you're confused. Demanding that you understand all of this right after what you went through is asking too much. Honestly, I still can't believe what happened. And that power... My persona... It's the will of your rebellion, Lady On. With it, you'll be able to fight in that other world. So if what you told me is true, we can make Kamoshida have a change of heart, right? Is it really possible? Can we actually force him to confess his crimes? The volleyball team's keeping quiet about this while teachers and parents turn a blind eye. If guys like us try and complain, they're just gonna shoot us down. Going all in on this plan is the only choice we got. Then let me help too. I want to make him pay for what happened to Shiho. He just keeps going like nothing happened. Even after what he did to her. I'll never forgive him. Wait, did you just say, let me help? You mean you want us to take you along? Don't act like I'm going to drag you down. Weren't you watching? I can fight too. Hey, what should we do? I agree as well. We are lacking in manpower after all. Don't worry, I'll protect her. Even if you said no, I'd just go in alone. Ah, right, she can go by herself. I guess it'd be more dangerous turning her down. Ah, fine. Then it's decided. Well, <laughs> I hope we get along. I'm going to make Kamoshida atone for what he did. Not just for Shiho's sake, but for everything he's done. I won't let any more people suffer because of him. I'll do whatever it takes. A group like yours must have relied on subtlety and misdirection. Otherwise, you'd never survive. Some of you might even have been hiding behind a public face their entire lives. If you're listening, then answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the lover's persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. when you're heading back in. Oh, wait. We don't have each other's info. Hey, give me your number and chat ID. And, um... I'll be counting on you then.
Same goes for you, Morgana. The pleasure is all mine, Lady On. What a kind girl. Such admirable consideration for others. And the innocence to cast herself into the jaws of death to achieve her goal. She cares about her friends, and she's beautiful to boot. What a girl. She's captured my heart. Dude. You know, it'd be better if this group could get together quick from now on. True. Our best option would be to make a secret hideout where we could discuss these things. A hideout, huh? I like the sound of that. The school rooftop would work. It seems like nobody goes up there. For the time being, that will make the perfect hideout. I can't contact you from inside a palace, so I'll stay in this world. That being said, I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm personally nominating you. You should feel honored. This is all you. There's no way I can at my place. The train will be arriving well, soon. we now have our hideout, so let's meet there tomorrow. Okay, let's go look at my new residence for this world. Stay upstairs while we're open for business. Yes? Hey, lay off the customers. <laughs> Sorry if he was rude, Doctor. I don't mind. Come on, you're getting in the way. Go on upstairs. Thanks. I'll see you later. Come back again. <laughs> That's it for today. Oh, that customer just now? She's the head doctor over at that clinic down the street. Rumor has it she gives pretty crappy examinations and sells some weird homemade medicines on top of that. At least, that's what I've heard. I haven't been there myself. They should really just leave her alone. It's not like she's getting in the way of their lives. Hey, are we there yet? <sighs> well, I gotta get home and start making dinner. Place. Is this some kind of abandoned house? Hey, are you? I was wondering why I heard meowing. What did you bring it here for? Nowhere, huh? Look, this place is a restaurant. Animals are a no-go. Though, I guess you might stay on good behavior if you've got a pet to take care of. Fine, but keep it quiet when we're open for business. And don't let it roam downstairs, or I'll toss it out. Oh, and I'm not going to take care of it. That's all on you. Was that the ruler of this place? He seemed pretty understanding for someone who keeps you cramped up in this dump. Then again, I suppose to normal people I just sound like a meowing cat. Seriously, I had to keep calling out in that cute little voice. Make sure you wash that dish. By the way, uh, have you decided on a name? Morgana? Huh, I was hoping I'd get to name it. Looks like the Chief likes me better than you. And to be honest, this place is heaven compared to Kamoshida's cells. Remember how you guys asked me before about what I am? To be honest, I don't remember anything about my birth. I think the metaverse's distortions made me lose both my memories and my true form. It has to be. I mean, why else would a cat be able to talk like this? There's no other possible explanation. There's no doubt that the distortions were what caused me to lose my real self. I'm sure that once they're purged, I'll finally be able to get that self back. And I have a pretty good idea on how to do it, too. That's why I was in the castle in the first place. Come to think of it, I didn't get hungry over in that world. Let me make myself clear. Your taking care of me won't be for nothing. It'll be give and take, due to my knowledgeable and dexterous nature. I have a lot of intel on infiltration tools. 
Wolf, I can't tell you more unless we settle on a deal. In exchange for you keeping me here, I'll teach you about these tools. How does that sound? I like that answer. <laughs> then it's a deal. Skillful infiltrations and escapes to all manner of places. There's even the possibility that you use special tools and had someone who manufactured them. Answer me. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Magician Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. you about the infiltration tools over time. By the way, the power you used in the palace was seriously amazing. The stronger that power gets, the more reliable it'll be as a trump card. All right, I'm gonna stick with you wherever you go from today on. Personas are the strengths born from one's heart. Depending on what kind of life experience you gain, I bet it'll affect that power as well. And if you become acquainted with capable people, you might learn various useful skills, too. This is all part of our deal. Got it? I expect great things from you. Don't let me down, okay? messages to each other with that thing, right? I won in two, so I'm gonna have to ask you to type for me. <sighs> well then. Oh! Are you listening? Looks like we're all here. Okay, let's get going. Hold on, it's still too early for us to head to the palace. But why? Don't we just gotta steal that treasure thing? Don't underestimate the dangers of that place. We need to prepare. Ain't that persona shit we got enough to deal with it? 
That's exactly what I mean when I say don't underestimate it. You'll die if you mess up in there. So again, we need to prepare before we head in. But how exactly are we supposed to do that? I'm glad you asked, Lady On. First, we'll need to find better equipment for all of you. You talking about weapons? Oh, I know a kick-ass place. In that case, you can handle that side of things. The only other thing would be stocking up on medicine. Fatigue is unavoidable in a palace. And where can we get medicine? Don't worry, I know just the place. I hope you look forward to it, Lady On. Now then, he and I have some business in Yongen, so let's head off for today. Just come with me. I won't be able to get close enough by myself. Can I talk? Actually... Hey! This is the clinic that the Chief mentioned. Now, how can we get them to give us some medicine? Well, I guess that's the only choice we have. We'll just have to go for it. All right, let's step inside. Well... Please head to the exam room. In a case like yours, it's usually just due to stress. I'm gonna prescribe you some pain relievers, okay? Actually, I still need to restock those. So let's go with sleeping pills instead. Sleep is the best medicine anyway. Which type of pill do you want? A sweet tasting one or a bitter one? How about a stinky one then? Just kidding, there's no such pill. All right, why don't we stop beating around the bush? You're not sick at all, are you? I'm not as dumb as I look, you know. I'm guessing you're here because you heard the rumors about me, hmm? You're one of those patients with an ulterior motive, huh? What's the world coming to? I guess high school kids have it tough nowadays too, huh? Well, fine. I'll prescribe you some medication. But only medication that will help you recover your health. I guess it's fine. You seem pretty earnest. And you don't look like you'll be any trouble. This is my private practice. All the medicine I dispense is original. I have a license to make my own formulas. You've likely seen them being sold at various hospitals. It's your responsibility to take care of yourself. So, if that's okay with you, stop by any time. Great. It's nice that you're so quick on the uptake. Saves me the hassle. You're a pretty weird kid, you know? I wonder what you're going to use the medicine for. Well, as long as you don't cause me any trouble, it's not my problem. Well, which do you want? Oh, okay. Oh, did you decide? Here you go. You want that one? Thanks. Take care.
able to get our hands on some decent stuff at this school we can leave that for tomorrow let's go home okay Everyone, wake up! This country is twisted. While Japanese society may appear to be thriving, many young people have not been as blessed as their elders. They have no jobs, no savings, no financial security whatsoever. These young people should be tackling their futures head on, but instead, they're too busy merely trying to survive. People give speeches all the time. Plus, politics are pretty boring anyways. The shop can be pretty confusing to find sometimes. Hey! Yeah! Oh yeah, uh, before we head in, you know anything about guns and shit? I guess we can just ask the guy behind the counter if we can't figure out what we want. Come on, let's do this. <laughs> you looking for recommendations? I don't know, just buy whatever looks interesting to you. Ugh, some customer service. Fine, what do you want? An automatic? A revolver? Uh... Automatic? Dude, why are you talking about cars now? Listen, this here's an enthusiast shop. My regulars will be mad if I let a casual like you hang around. I'm not a freaking casual. I bought shit from here like last week. Uh, can't remember you. You bastard. And you? Looking for something? Oh, you a collector? <laughs> You're way more interesting than Blondie over there. Oh, shut it! Anyways, you should have said before you two are enthusiasts. I'm always up for helping fresh faces. Some precautions first, though. Don't go around pointing them at other people. Keep them in a bag or something if you're outside. Oh, and don't let the fuzz catch wind of you having them. I don't need them coming around here. You damn well better be. Now, if you look close, you'll be able to tell these are models. Real guns feel... different. Maybe someday I'll show you the real good stuff, though. If you got the guts for it, of course. But for now, you get the beginner selection. Just sit tight. I'll bring them out. <laughs> we did it, dude. We totally gotta go for some fancy shit, right? Ooh, I want him to shine. Oh, and here's the cash for mine. Pick me out something good. All right, sounds good. That's what we better not use it to pull a prank. Hmm, do you like it? That's what you don't break it, okay? better not use it to pull a prank. Okay, all right, which one, huh? You don't break it, okay? That's what you're- You better not use it to pull a prank. Hmm, how's that? That's what don't break it, okay? All 
right. Sounds good. Hmm. You better not use it to pull a prank. That's what you do, like it? Hmm. How's that? That's what you do, like it? Uh, come again. Later. Did you hear? Apparently that subway driver from the accident was acting really odd during his testimony hearing. You talking about that psychotic whatever thing people are going on about? Yeah, I heard it completely alters your personality. The news is saying the driver couldn't even speak when they tried asking him questions. Only an idiot would believe a preposterous story like that. Oh, sorry, but we're closing soon. <laughs> How rude. This must be why you don't get many customers. Your coffee's actually not half bad. The beans must be lamenting the sorry state of this store. Thanks for stopping in. Please come again. Hmm. I'm only trying to help you fix your business. Thanks for the coffee, at least. Jeez, what a pain. Oh, what do you want? If you're bored, go wash some dishes or something. Doesn't concern you. It's all good as long as the shop doesn't fail. I'm not gonna go wearing a fake smile. No, it's nothing like that. As long as I'm here, the world leaves me be. No annoyances or troublesome people to deal with. It's like my own personal hideaway. I'd be kind of screwed if I lost it. But I guess you would be too. So you better at least try and be useful around here. Anyway, I'm leaving now. Don't cause any trouble. We're just about ready to go to the palace. We just need to assemble some infiltration tools. Clean off that desk back there so we can... That... Too hard about it. If Great. Yeah. We should be ready now. We're heading into the palace tomorrow. Let's get some sleep. Morning. Come on, hurry up and get to class. Good morning. That admirable behavior won't do you any good once you're expelled. Well, that wraps up the homeroom period. <clears throat> A word with you, please? There's something I'd like to ask you. It won't take long. I see you're already getting on top of the problem I'd mentioned this morning, Miss Kawakami. I appreciate the support. Thank you again. Oh, you know this guy, Yoshizawa? Yes, he lent me a helping hand earlier. I recommend you steer clear of the likes of him if you have any consideration for your future. Remember the discussion we just had? There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh! The delinquent transfer student? Sorry to interrupt, but I need to use the guidance office. Oh, pardon me. We should be going too. Don't want to get in the way of guiding this delinquent and all. Please excuse us. After you. I'm gonna get straight to the point. 
Did something happen between you and Mr. Kamoshida? <laughs> I don't think so. Especially after that little exchange just now. He gave me a brief lecture this morning, and your name came up. Something about the dangers of a lack of supervision. <laughs> I don't mean to pry, but just make sure you don't go causing trouble, okay? Oh, and one more thing. That girl outside the office? You didn't make a pass at her, did you? <laughs> I understand, but... Mr. Kamoshida has a real close eye on you. Apparently, you've been getting involved with Sakamoto-kun. You seem acquainted with Yoshizawa-san as well. Maybe you're just naturally drawn to athletes? Sorry, bad joke. That's all I wanted to discuss. You're free to go. understand that our time limit is May 2nd. We basically just have to go to that castle and steal the treasure from Kamoshida, right? But wait, what even is a treasure? I want to know that before we do anything. A treasure is the physical form of the palace ruler's distorted desires. In other words, it's the core of the palace. Once we steal it, the palace will crumble. I think. Having said all that, even I don't know what Kamoshida's treasure is going to be. And where can we find it? There's no way of knowing that until we go in and find out. But if I had to guess, I'd say he has it locked up somewhere in the depths of the palace. Uh, I think I get it now. We just gotta find the treasure, yeah? Pretty much. There's just a lot we won't know until we go in. In any case, our objective is to find the treasure's location somewhere in the palace. Make sure we go about this with time to spare so we can avoid any unforeseen circumstances. I expect great things from you guys. Okay, let's go. Damn! Hmm? What's up? N nothing. I, I was just thinking we should choose a code name for you, too. A code name? I'm Skull, he's Joker, and that's Mona. Judging by your costume. I mean, she's got that tail and stuff, so. What do you think? going to call me from now on? I am so not down with this. What do you want to be called then? Um, something better than just a little cat. Maybe... Panther? That sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? Huh? Why? Because it sounds more... ferocious? She's a cougar. Don't call me that! More importantly, Kamoshida. Oh, right. Let's go. All right. Let's start fresh and get going. It's game time from this point forward. I'll teach you guys the basics of infiltrating a palace as we go. My master would like a word with you. The prisoner has returned! Well done. It seems you have remembered my words. You truly make it worth rehabilitating you. 
<laughs> I am not attempting to withhold information from you. The essence of the rehabilitation that you must complete will be explained in due time. Once you encounter allies who share your ideals and discover your place in reality, only then will I explain it all. Such a day should not be far off. This time, I wish to introduce you to the aid we are providing. Due to your potential in wielding the power of the wild card, you can handle more than one persona. That power holds infinite possibilities. We will assist you in nurturing that potential. To that end, we must execute your persona. <laughs> Do not be alarmed. Personas are personalities that exist within you. Thus, you will only be discarding old personalities to have them be reborn as new ones. By discarding your old identity, you give way to a new one. Hence, we call that process. Think of it as the fusion of your personas. To start, select the first persona you wish to fuse. Now, before you select the second persona, allow me to tell you something greatly important. Do you remember how I mentioned forming bonds with confidants? Personas are the power of the heart. The stronger those bonds, the stronger your personas will be. In other words, the effects of your bonds on execution, or fusion, if you will, are quite substantial. When you fuse a persona that shares its arcana with one of your bonds, it will gain great power. This will be a guiding principle for your forays into fusion. Try not to forget it. Moreover, there is one thing I must warn you about. You cannot create a persona that surpasses your current level. This is because the resulting persona would be too powerful for you to handle effectively. Now then, check the fusion results and choose a persona that's this is the form your new persona is expected to take after fusion. It's possible for them to inherit skills they normally wouldn't gain. These skills and specialties are distinct from one another. Skills are traits that can be passed along through fusion. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Will it gain new power? I wonder. My, my. <laughs> I am Arsen, the other you who exists within. Though I may disappear this moment, I shall always be at your side. We shall meet again when your fate reaches its conclusion. <laughs> A stronger persona has been born from the body and blood of the old. It shall be your new strength. Its worth will be made clearer when you return to the field of battle. Gather personas and bring them here. Gather a great many, execute them, and continue to give birth to even stronger personas. Developing your powers as such will play an integral role in the stand against Ruin. So that your rehabilitation goes well, we have a variety of rituals to choose in regard to executions. 
And depending on the effort you put in, our master might consider further development of new rituals. Cry your tears of joy, inmate. Your heart is steadily gaining the strength of rebellion. It seems your rehabilitation is proceeding smoothly. A joyous fact indeed. In anticipation of this, I have prepared a gift for you. I hope that you shall accept it. All right. That is a thief's skill, allowing one to tap into their sixth sense and see what is hidden in the dark. I believe you can handle it now. May you continue devoting yourself to further rehabilitation. Now then, if you have any requests, we will heed them. I should write something.
Something wrong? You were just standing around all of a sudden. Why are you spacing out like that? It's kind of hard to tell what you're thinking sometimes. Let's just say he's a man of high caliber. We're counting on you, Joker! So, where do we start? Let's head to the safe room we found last time. It's in the first floor of the West Building. That's pretty close to our usual entrance. It should be a pretty decent starting point. Safe room? It'll make sense when you see it. Well, let's head out. Reveal your true form. Your true form. Okay, I'll show you an example first. You better look. Zora! Use this opportunity to baton pass and swap your turn with someone else. Take my turn! Sure. Next. Hold on! Zona. The baton pass made you do Step forward. Nice going. Reveal your true you? form. Victory. 
I'll reveal your Who true you? form. Wanna get going? Show me your true you? form! I'll reveal your true you? form. Do Joker. Show me your true you? form. Your Who true you? form. Hmm? Do 
you think? Piece of cake. Your true form. your true form. I don't think we're going any further this way. Should we check somewhere else? Wait, look up there! What about it? Are we throwing a rope over that and climbing it? Phantom thieves do things a bit more stylishly than that. And I know just what'll do the trick. Good. Seems like it fits properly. That's just a little something I've been working on in secret. The grappling hook lets you zip to hard-to-reach locations in a flash. You'll see what I'm talking about when you test it out. Go ahead, 
Give it a try. Okay. Hey, I spotted a strong one. Show me your true form. Persona! I leveled up. Okay. <laughs> no match for me. Show me your true form. Persona! We're done here. Let's go. Hmm. Nice work, team. I gotta use this next time. Okay. Shadow defeated. That was easy, huh? Trish I'll reveal your true form. Okay. Good work. Keep it up. Whoa. All right. Show me your true form. Joker. Okay. Mm. Huh. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Guess we gotta do it. Show me your true form. Suspicious. Hmm. <sighs> well, then, it's somewhere. How suspicious. We gotta do it. Oh! Huh? Hmm. Yeah! Is this... Uh... Oh! 
Uh, wait, it's all pics of her? <sighs> yeah, definitely. I feel even more motivated to do this now. I'm sure it'll feel awful, but we should search this room. There has to be something in here if he was hiding it with such an elaborate trick. Is... Oh, wait. Uh, so is it gonna tell us... Yeah, look. That's a... Consider... Uh? No. Now that we know how... Let's keep it... Itself, but it's not making any moves. Be careful. If my prediction is correct, that one's a bit problematic for us. All right, then I'll go take care of it. Just be careful. Yeah. Yeah. Whoa, what the hell? It started moving after we attacked it. Looks like it's exactly what I expected. Once we take it down... Hey, you two, watch this! What the? It exploded? I'll explain later. Focus on the battle for now. Here comes. best to take it down fast by striking its weakness and getting it to blow up. Uh Persona! This is amazing! Was that... the gym? I get it. The gym's some kind of holy place for him. He's a god there. I can't believe he can think like that. Especially after what he did to Shiho. God, that bastard makes me so freaking sick. Oh, just you wait, Kamoshida. I see. So you're the ones who tampered with the library. It seems my time waiting here has paid off. Just as that ape there said, this place is a holy ground for our great king, Kamoshida. It is preposterous for miscreants like yourselves to come waltzing in like this. You will pay for foolishly defying King Kamoshida with your lives. I knew this would happen. Well, we don't have a choice. Let's take it down! In thy name. Look! He's trying to do something! It's important to guard if you think you're in danger. Persona! Persona! <laughs> Oh, 
All right, level up. Damn it. I'll reveal your true form. me I'll reveal your true form Pretty shady. Joker. <laughs> this room seems different from everywhere else we've seen so far. Yeah. And there's something super suspicious over there. That's... Come on, follow me! What is this? Just what I thought. A will seed. How 
palaces are locations that grew distorted from their original forms due to their ruler's cognitions. When such distortions coalesce into form, this is the result. I call it a will seed. Distortions coalesce into will seeds? Should I try explaining that again? Uh, just forget it. That's a will seed. Moving on. So, what do we do with it? We take it. It may not be as prized as a treasure, but it's still quite the rare find. Making it ours will only do us good. I think. Um, is it really okay to take it? Nothing shitty better happen when you take it. Like some trap going off, or we all end up cursed. Nice. The will seat is ours. I guess nothing happened? There are more of these around here somewhere. As far as I can tell, there are two of them left. Huh? How can you tell? You smell them or something? Yeah, like how dogs can... Oh, but you're a cat. I am not a cat! I just seem like a cat. Treasure chest spotted. Must be something good. I'll reveal your true form. All right, Persona. <laughs> Losers. Mm. Nice work, team. All right. They were See too it. weak to bother with. There's a treasure chest! I'll reveal your true form. Alright. That's all it takes for me. Oh! Okay, let's go. I spotted a strong one. What are you gonna do? Show me your true form! Your true form. Persona! Right. The first move is ours! Yeah! Victory! Okay. That was so easy, I'm yawning. Uh. Show me your true form! I can feel it. 
Kamoshida's will seeds. Yes, that's the second will seed. Observation. Whoa! Um... Well... <laughs> huh? Listen up!
There's a treasure chest. Show me your true form. Arizona! The first move is ours! A spectacular victory! Okay. That's all it takes? Oh! I have something. <laughs> Show me your true form! Step forward. Okay. <laughs> no match for me. This is a safe. I'll reveal I your true you. form. Nice work, team! Alright. That's all it takes for me. I'll reveal your true you? form. Whoa! That shadow was crazy! All enemies defeated! Just what I'd expect Who's from you, next? Joker! Yeah! Victory! All right. Man, that was easy. Oh no. There's... I'll reveal your true form. What the hell are you doing? You have a chance to strike. Yeah. All enemies defeated. Just what I'd expect from you, Joker. Okay. I'll reveal your true you? form. Alright, time. The first move is ours. All enemies defeated. Just what I'd expect from you, Joker. Okay. That's all it takes for me. I'll reveal your true form. Okay. E yeah. <sighs> okay, let's go. <sighs> Didn't even break a sweat. For real?
flawless victory. I have something. Show me your true form. That shadow has a lot of health. Joker, I taught you how to strike your opponent's weakness. If you could blind it or put it to sleep, you'd have an easier time doing real damage. It's time. <laughs> Losers. All right. All right. Huh? Noticed us yet. Now's our chance. Focus. Reveal your true you? form. This place. Holy shit! That treasure thing's gotta be in here. Hey, what is this? It's floating in the air. 
<laughs> That's the treasure. We finally found it. Just hold on a second. I was planning on telling you more once we made it this far. Simply finding the treasure isn't enough. We'll need to make it materialize before we can steal it. What do you mean? Desires have no physical form by nature. Hence, we'll first need to make the real person aware that their desires are in fact a treasure. Once they're conscious that their desires might be stolen, the treasure will finally show itself. But how do we do that? We warn them. Tell them, we are going to steal your heart. So we're gonna send a calling card? Oh, that's totally what a phantom thief would do! Once we do that, the treasure will appear for certain. Uh, I think. That again? Either way, sounds like it's worth giving it a shot. Our infiltration route is secure. All that's left now is to pump out a calling card in reality, then come back to take the treasure. This is it, huh? That's the spirit. Once we send out the calling card, there will be no turning back. Just let me know when you're ready. We'll head back to the hideout and send out that calling card. Well then. Hey! What do you want to do? All right. Well done. challenge is coming up. I hope you're ready. Hey! Well then. Oh. Listen up. That should do it for now. Started. This is it. I see. Okay.
All right. All right. See ya. Hey. Oh, yeah. Hey. Wow. Mm. Hey. Oh. Okay. Oh. Nice. Yeah. Mm. Well then. Hey. Hmm. I should write something.
What are you trying to do? Did you change your mind? Evening. Do you remember anything from the moment you took the medicine until now? Hmm. By the look in your eyes, I'd say you don't. You briefly woke from your coma, but you were completely dazed during the entire examination. You eventually lost consciousness and fell back asleep. Are you out of your mind? Only an idiot would have drank that. Fine. By the way, the reason you lost consciousness was because of the taste. It produces a foul smell when it mixes with gastric juices, similar to Sir Stroming. Oh well, all that matters is that thanks to you, I was able to get some good data. Okay, it's my turn to make good on my part of the deal. That's why I waited until you woke up. I don't want the general public to know about my original medicines. So, you're strictly prohibited from disclosing what happens here to anyone. Understood? Then it's a deal. As long as you come here for it, I'll give you the medicine at a good price whenever you want. I may even add additional selections in time. I look forward to your continued patronage. Considering all the actions you've taken, you must have had someone with medical expertise. Who? And how did you treat your wounds? It'll be easy to find out who if we look into this, you know. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Death Persona, 
I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. So, when can you come back for the next clinical trial? Oh, you don't remember that part either? Well, I was saying that teenage test subjects are quite valuable in the medical research industry. So I'll provide you the medicine for your entrance exams, and in exchange, you'll be my guinea pig. I have to perfect this medicine. If you're able to move now, you can go home. All right, take care. school. You're not causing any trouble, are you? Good. I've got to report to your probation officer twice a month. It's already a pain in the ass as is, so please don't make me have to write even more crap. Got that? This society is kept in check by laws and authority figures. You can go and get yourself killed if you want, but don't go dragging other people into your mess. The last thing we need is more idiots like you roaming around. Hmm? What's wrong? Yeah, I'm heading out now. Sorry about that. I know. The usual, right? Okay. I'll see you later. As you can see, I'm pretty damn busy both at work and in my private life. If you could lend a hand, it'd really be a great help. Now we're talking. Either way, I won't ask you to work for free. If you agree to help me, then... I'll teach you how to make the perfect cup of coffee. Not a bad trade, eh? All right. Looks like we got ourselves a deal. You may call yourself a phantom thief, but you're still a miner. Someone had to support you. Furthermore, they did so knowing you were a part of that group. Isn't the owner of that cafe an accomplice of yours? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Hierophant persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. I'll be counting on your help. I owe you one. Oh. I'm gonna head back then.
to the exam room. What? By the way, all right. Take care. Do it for now. Hey, hmm. Hmm. Wow. Hey. Huh? 
All right. All that's left now is to send out the calling card and take Kamoshida's heart. Couldn't we have just sent one at the beginning of all this? It's not that simple. A treasure won't stay materialized forever. Once the impression is gone, the treasure will disappear. I think it'll last around a day at most. The hell? That's like no time at all. Anyways, we can send a calling card right now. Now then. I've been waiting to hear you. Tomorrow's finally the day. So we send the calling card in the morning and carry out the plan by the end of the day, right? Correct. The effect won't last that long. Are you worried? <laughs> Waited too long. Perfect. Going to pull this off no matter what. So, who's going to write the card? Leave it to me! Why? Why? Why wouldn't it be me? This is important. Are you sure you can handle the pressure? I must agree. I really want to get him good. Let me write it. Uh, come on, please. Gotcha. I got a hundred things I want to hurl at that bastard rattling around in my head. Just make sure it's not obvious who wrote it, all right? I know, I know. All right then, tomorrow it is. You'd better not slack off on this. Well then. Card. I heard it was already posted by the time everyone got here this morning. Sir Suguru Kamoshida, the utter bastard of lust. We know how shitty you are, and that you put your twisted desires on students that can't fight back. That's why we have decided to steal away those desires and make you confess your sins. This will be done tomorrow, so we hope you will be ready. From the Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Wow. Not bad, huh? I looked up a bunch of similar stuff online for reference. Um, yeah. I know what you wanted to say, but it sounded like an idiot trying to be an adult. Your logo's a little lacking, too. Okay, you know what? That ain't true. Did Mr. Kamashita do something wrong? Does this mean the rumors are true? Wait a sec. Is someone gonna take something from Mr. Kamashita? What's with this weird logo? And who are these Phantom Thieves of Hearts people? It got everyone excited, so it's all good, yeah? Who's responsible for this? Look at that. A predictable reaction for someone who knows what we mean by distorted desires. I think it's hitting him pretty hard. Did you do this, or was it you? Was it you two? So you're playing dumb? <laughs> it's not a problem. You'll be expelled soon enough anyway. Come, steal it if you can.
Judging from Kamoshida's response, I'm sure we had an effect on his palace. Does that mean the treasures appeared? We'll be able to get it today, right? It's not just today. It's only today. The impact of seeing a calling card doesn't last long. And it cannot be repeated. This will be our one chance to steal the treasure. One day's more than enough for us. Kamoshida's desires? T treasure Uh, the cat's acting awfully excited. What's wrong? Is something... Enough, you stupid cat. <clears throat> oh, um, yeah. Uh, forgive me for displaying such an insolent sight in front of a lady. You were completely out of character, too. Well, what was that about? I couldn't stop it either. To think I'd be drawn to human desires this much. <gasps> Doesn't that prove that I'm human? How should we know? Uh, anyway, you guys need to carry it. All you do is bark orders. Still, that was easier than I thought. I thought for sure there'd be some insane trap or something. This palace will disappear if we take this back, right? And Kamoshida will change, too. That should be the case. Good. Now's our chance, then. It's heavy. To think it'd go so well. I've even found three Persona users in the process. My judgment was correct. I made the right choice in making a deal with you. Yahaha! <laughs> All right. Go, go, let's go, Kamoshida! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone take this. This proves that I am the king of this castle. It is the core of this world. That rat bastard. That's how he sees me, isn't it? Yo, pervert! Were you waiting to ambush us? I just made it easier to find you. I'll dispose of you myself. Right here, right now. That's our line, you sexually harassing D-bag! What a selfish misunderstanding. How is it a misunderstanding? You were doing things that you kept in secret from others. People around me were the ones who kept it secret. Adults who want to share in my accomplishments. Students who have the drive to become winners. They willingly protect me so that we all may profit from it. Profit? There are too many imbeciles who don't understand that. Including naive brats like you and that girl who tried to kill herself. True. She's a total idiot. Letting you manipulate her. Trying to commit suicide. And I'm even more of a dumbass for not realizing that. No matter what kind of fool someone might be. 
They don't need your permission to live their lives! Drop the attitude, you mediocre peasant! There is no wrong in using my gifts for my gain! I'm a cut above all other humans! Above? You mean beneath? You're a goddamn demon obsessed with your sick desires! <laughs> That's right! I'm not like you! you as a condescending hotshot, but right now, you're just a pathetic loser. We came all this way to steal that. Will you just give it up and hand it over? Silence! I will let the lights of you have this! You still have the energy to say things like that? Then we're going to up our game as well. Let's go! You dare strike me! Mishida's cognitive version of him. It's not the real Mishima. It feels like he's gonna attack. Keep your guard up! Come with my 
King Kamoshiro, I've brought you your ball, just like you asked. Now I'm rising good girls as good. Yeah, all women should obey my orders like this. Ain't that right, sweetheart? No way! What's Shiho doing here? Panther, calm down. That's not the real one. Y yeah, you're right. But this is just... Dude, even Suzuki too. You've gone too far, you piece of shit. Oh, I get it. You want to see my kill shot again, don't you? What do we do? Right. Sona. You just right ah! Joy was useless. Looks like I'll have to give her some special instruction later. One on one! Kamoshida, I'll never forgive you! Sorry, Suzui. I swear we'll beat that bastard's ass. We won't get anywhere with. What do we do? I see. And look over at that table. While the others are drunk, let's steal the. I'm in trouble! trouble. trouble. Pat, someone heal her! Persona! Time for my persona! What? Ugh, is it? Leave it to me! Attack persona! Keep him busy! You just strike me! Ugh. I'm in trouble! Not running away. Why don't you run? Aren't you a great athlete? It's always been like this. All those goddamn hyenas forcing their expectations on me. I'm doing this all for them. What's wrong about demanding a reward for that? Now you're making excuses. We'll do something about that distorted heart of yours. <laughs> Scared right now? You're seeing the same view that Shiho did. I'm sure she was scared too. Except she had no choice but to jump. What will you do? Will you jump? Or would you rather die here? <laughs> do you want to finish him off? It's your call. No, please wait. I beg you. Just forgive me. Shut up. I bet everyone told you the same. But you... You took everything from them! No! I... I accept defeat. You want this? Take it. Uh, uh. Go ahead and finish me off. You do that, and my real self will go down too. You have that right, since you've won. <laughs> On! If his mind shuts down, he can't admit his crimes. You're kind, Lady On. <sighs> I've lost. You're through when you lose. What am I? What am I supposed to do now? I will leave now and return to my real self. I'll make sure. Whoa! Hey, just so you know, we don't have time to waste. This place is about to collapse. Run! 
can't go there anymore. What about the treasure? What the? A medal? Wait, where'd that crown go? What's going on? It means that was the source of Kamoshida's desires. To him, this medal is worth as much as that crown we saw in the palace. An Olympic medal. So, that perv kept clinging to his past glory and couldn't let it go. But... This means that Kamoshida's heart might have changed, right? Probably. Our expulsion's on the line here! This is the first successful example for me, too. However, there's no doubt that this has affected Kamoshida's personality quite a lot. The entire palace disappeared, after all. Uh, I feel all antsy. Ain't there a way to check now? We'll just have to wait and see Kamoshida's next move. Come on, why the gloomy faces? Be happy! We completed this with great success, you know. We just don't know if everything's okay yet. I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. Remember how Kamoshida's shadow said that he's returning to his self in reality? We all know Suguru Kamoshida is scum. Still, he did seem to regain his conscience somewhat before he disappeared. There are definitely those who have been saved, thanks to what you've done. Yeah. Anyways, I guess we gotta wait. It all boils down to what's gonna happen to Kamoshida. Or if we're getting expelled for real. Yeah. Let's go. Basically, the treasure, though, the how's that? Hey, well, then, oh, mm. that should do it for now.
Ah, you're back. Well then. Hmm? Oh. Hey. Well then. Oh. Should do it for now. Hey, hey, hmm? Hmm. oh. this question. Moshida? You really think he changed? Well, yeah. Oh, perfect timing. The study hall will be held instead of PE today. I'm letting you know just in case you haven't heard. Mr. Kamoshida has taken the day off. He ain't here? Don't tell anyone that you heard this from me. But we received word that Mr. Kamoshida is placing himself under suspension. It's such an important time before the tournament, too. Principal Kobayakawa went to talk to him about it, but he supposedly wasn't making any sense. Wait, a suspension? Not so loud! The talks about your expulsions may be put on hold, too. I don't know too much about it, though. Anyway, I've relayed what's going on to you. Something happened. At least it sounds different from the mental shutdown. I guess all we can do is wait. to the exam room. Take care.
Ah, you're back. today, huh? How do you like being packed in like sardines, city style? <laughs> I bet you've had enough. I don't mean to joke around. I just don't know what to do. I get anxious unless I'm doing something, yet here I am suddenly with nothing to do. It's so awful just waiting for the results, isn't it? It's so worrying. You too, huh? Uh, of course you are. Sorry for asking such a weird question. I guess all we can do is wait. I wonder how Shiho's condition is, too. Man, all this heavy talk first thing in the morning. Both of us need to switch gears. a new regimen to your rehabilitation in the form of challenge battles. For these trials, we will permit the cognitions of your comrades to fight at your side. <laughs> Cry your tears of joy! Depending on your results in combat, you will receive some form of compensation for your efforts. Should you prove successful, there is no doubt that you will be rewarded and strengthened in body and mind. We've even prepared a special stage for you to undergo this part of your rehabilitation. Take this opportunity to demonstrate the furthest reaches of the strength you've gained up to now. Should you wish to attempt this at once, we shall oblige you. Oh. Done already? What? It is time, inmate. Thank <laughs> you. 
All right. All right. Which one? Uh, come again. We had no we're gonna go out somewhere to get well don't get ahead of yourself look knowledge isn't enough you need proficiency to you also need kindness to be accepted plus the quality really but I
Let me explain. do it for now. Please head to the exam room. Bye. did do what we could, but how will that Appreciate it.
you want to do? Hmm. for now. Sorry. Oh. Hmm. Yo. Yeah. Let's go. Whoa. while we wait for tomorrow. Hey! I'll just add this. 